did Tyler Perry seduce Kristen Case? The answer is no. Despite the rumors and speculations, there is no evidence that Tyler Perry sexually harassed or assaulted Kristen Keys, his former co-star and protege. In fact, Keys himself has appeared to confirm that Perry was not the Hollywood powerful man who violated him for years. Keys, who rose to fame through his work on the early media plays and the Bet series All the Queen's Men, recently went live on Instagram to reveal that he was a victim of sexual abuse by a wealthy and influential figure in the film industry. He claimed that this person, whom he did not name, frequently made passes at him, offered him $100,000 to strip naked, and once tried to grab his penis. He said he had audio recordings of the person's voice and planned to turn them over to the police. Many fans and media outlets speculated that the culprit was none other than Perry who is known to be a billionaire and a mentor to many black actors. However, Keyes seemingly denied this by liking the tweet that said, Watching Christian Keyes and can tell he is clearly a victim dot 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 only three dollars grand to his name and violated by a gay billionaire. And no, I don't believe it was Tiki. I wish Christian would have taken action dot 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 that man will still have his money and good name and Christian will remain broken. Perry has not commented publicly on the matter, but he has been supportive of Key's career and has executive produced his show All the Queen's Men, which was adapted from a novel that Keyes wrote. Therefore, it is unlikely that he was involved in the sexual harassment allegations. Sources Jonathan Major's Guilty Verdict Will Megan could dump him? Jonathan Majors, the star of Loki and the Hard of Day 4, has been found guilty of assault and battery for punching a photographer in New York City last year. He faces up to one year in jail and a $1,000 fine. Majors was accused of attacking the paparazzo who was trying to take pictures of him and his girlfriend, actress Megan Good, outside a hotel in Manhattan on December 12, 2022. The photographer claimed that Majors punched him in the face, breaking his nose and causing him to lose consciousness. Majors denied the allegations and said he acted in self-defense. However, a jury did not buy his story and convicted him on December 22, 2023, after a three-day trial. The judge postponed his sentencing until January 10, 2024 and released him on bail. Majors' lawyer said he was disappointed with the verdict and planned to appeal. He also said that Majors and Good were still together and supported each other through this ordeal. Good, who is best known for her roles in Think Like a Man and The Intruder, has not spoken publicly about the incident or the verdict. She has been dating Majors since 2020 and they have been seen together at various events and red carpets. She has also praised him for his acting skills and his personality.